Hi everyone, welcome to Western Sydney University's online talks. I'm David Arness. I teach across a range of units in psychology and I'm also an academic course advisor. Today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the structure of studying psychology at Western Sydney University, uh, what some of the key milestones along the way are, and a little bit about the, sort of the culture of studying at university and hopefully to tantalize you into coming and uh, checking us out. So if you've been considering studying psychology at Western Sydney University, I'm sure one of the main questions you have is which course you might want to do. Well, there's a range of options for completing your psychology degree at Western. Um, the primary, the flagship course is the Bachelor of Psychology Honours. That's a four year program that rolls in the honours component for students who meet the academic threshold. The other two core pathways that we offer are the Bachelor of Social Science Psychology and the Bachelor of Arts Psychology. These are both three year degrees that contain the foundational studies in psychology and package it together with programs from within different areas of study. So the social sciences are particularly attractive for students who are interested in pursuing a career within the social sciences. So sociology, social work, um, child and community, or you know, policing or criminology, things of that nature. Bachelor of Arts is more attractive for students who might want to work in communications or, or of course arts and education and politics. Um, things that, uh, these are things that provide a point of difference for those courses. Of course, those programs also have a lower ATAR target, and so that makes it more attractive also, depending on your personal circumstances. We do offer a couple of other pathways for studying psychology. For example, the Bachelor of Arts has the option of doing a double degree with laws, um, while also completing the foundational studies in psychology. Now, this pathway is uh, evidently much longer and it has a much higher ATAR target, but it's worth keeping in mind as an option if law is in particular something that you're interested in completing. Now, finally, the Graduate Diploma of Psychological Studies is a compressed degree that includes just the foundational studies in psychology. So it's a much faster way to complete your three-year degree However, it's only available for students who have previously completed a bachelor degree. But if that's something that you've already done, then by all means do get in touch to discuss this option. And just a quick overview, uh, we have three core campuses that we teach our psychology programs from, and these include Bankstown, Parramatta South, and Penrith, or Kingswood campus. To help you try and narrow down which pathway might be most appropriate for you, uh, just have a think about the course structure for the three main programs that we offer, the Bachelor of Psychology Honours, Bachelor of Social Science Psychology, and the Bachelor of Arts, with a key program in psychology. You can see in the course structure that the psychology foundation units are all the same. So you complete the same pathway of study in terms of psychology. It's the additional content that you have the opportunity to study around it that really defines what the courses are about. Now, the Bachelor of Psychology is the most flexible degree. It gives you the opportunity to include eight open electives. And so that means you, you can study social sciences or arts from within the Bachelor of Psychology program, or you can focus on completing a deeper set of psychology electives or electives from anywhere else in the university that interests you. The Bachelor of Social Science and the Bachelor of Arts, on the other hand, include a range of core units from within those specific disciplines. On top of that, you also have the opportunity to engage with specialisations from within those areas. So those main differences separate the, the, the programs. You can get a deeper understanding of what these courses involve by checking out the relevant uh, course handbook pages. All of our psychology programs at Western Sydney 
offer you a foundational three-year package of training in psychology. It's an accredited three-year pathway that prepares you for your fourth year. The fourth year is an essential component if you're interested in becoming a registered psychologist. Uh, it's also a useful initial training in the research side of psychology. So once you've completed your three-year degree, the options for undertaking your fourth year depend a little bit on where you started. So the Bachelor of Psychology Honours Program, as mentioned, is a four-year program. So it rolls in your fourth year uh, if you meet the academic targets. From the other pathways in psychology, you have to apply into the fourth year. And that would be applying into the Bachelor of Psychological Studies on it. And so as a, as a Western Sydney University student, you have the option of continuing on to your fourth year within, within either of our key programs. The Graduate Diploma in Psychology, on the other hand, is our fourth year program for students who have completed a three year program at another institution. So that's another option to consider, depending on where you've come from previously. We've so far been looking at the undergraduate program at Western Sydney University, which includes your three year foundational training plus the fourth year honours. After that, the steps to becoming a registered psychologist include additional advanced training. This here is the pathway to registration psychologist slide provided by Australian Psychological Society that outlines the, the various pathways that you can take to becoming a psychologist. Now, these are both very competitive pathways to get into, but they offer valuable training uh, that set you up well to become a good practicing psychologist. The two pathways of advanced training that we offer at Western, the Master of Professional Psychology and the Master of Clinical Psychology, both include coursework training as well as supervised practice, which you can actually complete partly through working at the clinic that we have established at Western Sydney University. This provides practical hands-on training in the relevant skill sets that you're going to be developing in this later practice. One of the main questions that we often get is, how hard is it to get into honours? What's the likelihood that you're going to get a place in, in that program? Well, the Australian average across all of the different psychology programs is approximately one place for every 11 year one to three students. That's a little bit under 10% of students having the capacity to go on to their fourth year. The good news is that at Western Sydney, because of our active research profile, we are able to offer a place for every five year one to three students. Within the Bachelor of Psychology Honours Program, this fourth year is guaranteed if you meet our academic standards. For the other pathways, you need to meet those standards and then also apply competitively. But it's worth keeping in mind that the fourth year is available as an additional step it's a necessary step if you want to become a psychologist, but there are many other uh, rewarding pathways available for students who aren't interested or don't actually get into the honours program. The foundational degrees in psychology that we offer, whether it be a three-year uh, undergraduate program or the fourth year Bachelor of Psychology, they all offer you a great launching pad to move into various areas uh, of working within the mental health area or the social work area, or even a research area, if that's, uh, if that's, an, if that's an option that interests you. At Western, we offer a range of uh, postgraduate training, such as Master of Social Work and Art Therapy, um, or indeed the Master of Psychotherapy and Counselling. These are all options that are available for students who have completed a three-year undergraduate pathway. You don't need to complete your honours in order to, uh, to pursue various pathways of, um, of, high, uh, of advanced training. And indeed, you don't actually need to complete advanced training in order to make use of your degree. There are many different... There are many different... Uh, career pathways that are available for students who have completed a degree such as Bachelor of Psychology or the Bachelor of Social Science Psychology or indeed Bachelor of Arts Psychology and 
and they are as varied as those degrees are. So there's potential pathways for students who are interested in, uh, in social work or in uh, community welfare or um, uh, working in various uh, areas of education or in um, mental health and counselling. Studying at university is, uh, it's an initial step into developing your, essentially your skill set or your portfolio, portfolio moving into a, uh, a rewarding career. Now, whether, that, whether you're doing that through advanced training or moving straight into the workforce, one of the really great opportunities that we offer at Western, uh, studying as a psychology student, is a partnership with Wesley Mission where they provide joint training in a certificate four of mental health. This training provides a, uh, essentially a hands-on um, approach to working with, uh, uh, within the mental health uh, field. And it can provide you with both a look into what that field is like, as well as an opportunity to develop the skill sets that will be relevant for a whole range of um, a whole range of career opportunities uh, uh, going past your third year degree. Whether you go into um, counselling or social work, um, or into um, uh, attempting to become a registered psychologist, uh, this kind of training provides um, provides a really good look into uh, what it's like out in the field. We've really only been able to get to the tip of the iceberg of the experiences and opportunities of studying psychology at Western Sydney University. But I'd really like to thank you for your time listening to me today. And I look forward to seeing you one day soon, perhaps, or to receiving any questions you might have about, uh, about the opportunities of studying at Western. Thank you very much and have a great day.